Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 11th of January 2024, morning time here in Bangkok. Let's hope it's a great day for me and for you and for everybody else. Uh, as great as it possibly can be, although some people are living in horrific circumstances, of course. Um, I wonder uh, if uh, Chris Kais, Trump's lawyer, will ever regret the fact that he I think he was paid $3 million to go and work for Trump. Um, but I, I hope he got the money up front. I know he got the money up front because Trump is famous for not pay, paying his lawyers. But um, I wonder if in the future he will regret the fact that he let Trump dictate so much. Because apparently he had a reasonable reputation before he went to work, work for Trump. But if you've seen the latest email exchange with Jump Judge Engoron in the New York court case... Uh, you will see good grief. People sell their souls to the devil when they agree to work for Trump and agree to all of his nonsense. Trump was uh, saying that he should run the closing argument or have uh, speak as part of the closing arguments in the case where he refused to testify. I mean, he had the chance to testify under oath, but he wouldn't do that. So he's probably watched too many Hollywood movies and decided, hey, I could be, you know, is it? Atticus Finch or something. I'm going to be like the great lawyer who's going to say any nonsense because they can say a lot of stuff and get away with a lot of stuff during closing arguments. Um, but the judge said, OK, if you want to speak at the end, you have to stick to the facts. You're not allowed to go off topic. Uh, you got to stay on course and talk about this case and relevant matters only. And if you don't, I'm going to take you out and fine you. And if you <laughs> And in the end, I'm just going to stop you from speaking if you just continue to do so. And the email exchange went backwards and forwards. Then Chris Kai said, oh, Trump's mother-in-law, that's Melania, Trump's mother died. And he needs more time now. You know, can we get an extension? The judge wrote back saying no. And uh, quite rightly, I mean, as if Trump gives a damn about his mother-in-law, he doesn't really give a fig about Melania, does he? Uh, it's so ridiculous. And anyway, in the end... Uh, the judge, because the, the the judge set a timeline and said a time limit and said if you don't respond by midday, uh, then you are not then Trump will not be speaking and they didn't. Except the last email was like this is so unfair. Sounds like a character from The Simpsons or something, you know. Just disgraceful, disgraceful people. All of his Trump's lawyers, Trump supporters, Trump's lawyers, they're all as bad as each other. All right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? I'm going to start with ones blocking across like this and the one blocking down here which puts one into one of those squares blocking that way and the one blocking down here that's going to give me a one in that square we can take ones to the top did I mention this is the guardian hard level puzzle I think I forgot now you know but you knew already because you clicked on it right so you saw the link uh, let's just go through in numerical fashion, shall we? We've got two blocking across here and two down here. If I can hold the right key down, which will give us two in one of those squares. Blocking down here, down here, two across there. There's a two, two this way, and that way will give us two there. Two up here, and two up there. Four up, four down, four across, four in. Four across here, four down there. Four up here, four down there. Five down here and here, and across there, there's a five. Six across here and six up there. There's a six. I've noticed we've got five and six in these rows, so that's going to put five and six in those squares, isn't it? Um, let me just have another look at the sixes. Is there anything else I can do immediately? Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, so this is five and six. So we're looking for... Four, 
seven, nine, and we've got four and seven together, so that's going to be a nine. We'll put the nine in there. Actually, there's another nine we can grab while we're at it, going up to the top there. Okay, uh, I forgot where we were. Sixes. Don't we got any more sixes yet? I'm going to go back to ones again and then I'll look a bit harder at other things. Okay, yep, we have fours now that we didn't have before. Four in that square, four down here, four across there. And that's a four. And I said this was five, six, so this has got to be the seven then. Seven up here, seven across there and there. Four is actually finished. Eight up here and eight across there, so there's our eight. And seven and eight block across here and seven and eight block down here, so that's a pair of seven and eight in those squares. Oh, look, there's only one number left here anyway. <laughs> uh, what is missing here? I missed that. Is the nine, isn't it? So the nine goes there. And I said seven and eight are in those squares. This is going to be a one. And the missing digit up here is going to be another nine, I guess. Nine across here and here. There we go with a nine. eight blocks this square here we need an eight in this row that's the eight um, and the missing digit here is two two blocks across here which gives me a two there one blocks down here so this is one one blocks across here and up there there's a one the last number to place here is a three three blocks across here and up there so there's a three Eight, uh, eight blocks down here, that's our eight. Eight across here gives me an eight in that square. The last number here is seven, I think. Seven blocking up here and across here, there's a seven. Eight blocking this square, there's our eight. This is a five. Last number to place over here is no, it's not a six. What is it? F no, 
Um, can't find you. Eight. <clears throat> okay, we've got eight like this. That I think this is the last one. Yeah. Missing numbers down here, three, seven, and nine. We've got three and seven in the same column. That will be our nine then. So nine up here, up there, and across there gives me nine in that square, nine across here, and up there finishes the nines. One more number to go here, which is six, I think. And six blocks across there. So there's our six, and six across there, six up there. Six down here gives me six there and six down here puts the six away uh, this will be five and we need a five here five blocks up there there's our five five across here and up there and there goes a five uh, here we're looking for a three and we need a three there and three blocks across there so that'll be a three three blocks down here there's a three the last number is a seven here and there and that's our um, what is it? Um, oh, Guardian hard level puzzle over for Thursday. Thank you very much. Bye bye.